welcome back to our two minute devos. We are on day 31 of our 40 days of prayer here at Cave First. And if you grab your prayer journals, you'll see that we're in Psalm chapter 130. Psalms 130 is a great psalm. And what I love about verses three and four is hypothetical meeting truth. A hypothetical we have is verse three, but Lord, if you kept a record of our sins, who, O oh Lord, could ever survive? This is the hypothetical. We get this word if, if you did this. Now, some of you think that God constantly has this record that's stacked against you, that he is keeping uh, every little footnote of everything you've ever done in your life, and he is waiting to use it against you at the least, most convenient moment. You've got that mindset about God. Why? Because we see human beings do that. We see people in our life doing that. If they know enough about someone, that they're ready to say something against them or do something about them. And we think that God is that way. So the psalmist gives us something to stop, pause, and think about. It's this hypothetical that if God kept a record, none of us could stand. None of us would survive. But then he counteracts the hypothetical with truth. What's the truth? Verse 4. But you offer forgiveness that we might learn to fear you. That word fear is not to be scared. It's to have awe and respect. But Lord, if you kept a record, who could survive? But it's all good because in you there is forgiveness. I want you to stop, pause, and think about that today when you're in times of prayer because I guarantee when you think of all the stuff that you've done and all the forgiveness that's found in Jesus Christ, I guarantee it will make you drop to your knees, lift up your hands with, with complete gratitude and thanksgiving to thank you the Lord for the wonderful, rich mercy and grace that he pours out so richly upon our lives. So today, would you stop, pause, and think about the grace of God, think about the forgiveness that he offers, and just bask in the attitude of gratitude as we just continue to lift up the Lord and say thank you, God, for pouring your forgiveness upon our lives. That's all I've got to say today. We'll see you tomorrow as we're continuing through our series.